Hello everyone, I'm back with another bin of coolness. I think this is a, yep, this is a mint in box video here. It looks like a, lots of good stuff, so let's get started. Got this Pacific Rim rubber baby Otachi figure. This thing's very cool. Very cool indeed. Now these are some treats here. Um, it's Conan. This is Toph Amon, the enemy. I have them all wrapped in bubble wrap. But these are some of my favorite collections. This is the Jewel Thief. Love, love these uh, Remco Conan figures. That is super cool. One of these days I'll have them all displayed. This is my Warrior Beast Skull Man. You see. <laughs> Love these. Uh, what is this? This is the Masters of the Universe weapons pack. Very cool. I might need to open that. The card's kind of beat up, so I was thinking about opening it so I could use the the yellow Beast Man armor. Here's another Warrior Beasts figure. Very cool. Love Warrior Beasts. Here's another one. Triceratops. Alright. All right, here is Makola. Lucked out and got several of these way back in the day before prices got all jacked up. Right here's some, no longer my address, but all right, come on. There's another Realm of the Underworld figure. Thick. All right, that's the. I think that's Hercules. Yeah. His name down here. Yep, Hercules. Hercules, son of Zeus. Take all these out of the bubble wrap, and then you guys can see them when I do my walkthrough. This is Arch Fiend. Unpunched. Okay, you can see what this one is. Another is it, uh, Arch Fiend. Different version. Very cool. Alright, now we get into the stuff that we can actually see. There's a Star Wars. I think this is Count Dooku's saber. Love these. So fun to play with. Alright. Here is the Star Wars Evolutions of the Sith Legacy. Some very cool figures. Darth Nihilus, Darth Bane, and Darth Maul. Very cool. Love this set. Here is the Fett Legacy with Mandalore, Knights of the Old Republic, 
Django Fett, Attack of the Clones, and Boba Fett, The Empire Strikes Back. That one is amazing. Love the look of that one. And here's another one. The Darth Maul Returns Battle Pack. With Darth Maul First Appearance. Is that the one with the robot legs? And then you get the Night Sister, which is amazing. And the Savage Opress, Darth Maul's brother. It's one of my favorite packs. And I actually got this one on clearance for 10 bucks. That's an awesome deal. I think this pack's worth quite a bit of money now. I could be wrong. I don't know. It's been a while since I looked. This is an amazing piece as well. This Thundercats line didn't really get much love, but this Mamra's Storm Charger is an amazing vehicle. That thing is just so cool. I have a lot of the figures and stuff from this line. Very cool. Three and three quarter size Thundercats line. But that, that's my favorite piece out of that whole line. Here's a Night at the Museum 3 glow-in-the-dark skeleton. Looks like I got it for 50 cents at a yard sale probably. Or a thrift store. Who knows. There's another Bone Age piece. The Stegus. Very cool. I love Bone Age. Um, the Dinosaurs. I love, love, love this line. The Giganto Dragon. This piece is so cool. I believe I have all these loose too. I got some of my favorite pieces in the box. That line is just, oh my god, this line is so cool. I just love the look of these metallic and transparent plastic dinosaurs. Dino Morph Action, Dino Brachio. These things are flipping cool. Some of the coolest toys I've ever seen. Okay, and here is the Dino T-Rex. I might have opened this one. Either that or the sword fell, which is a good possibility. Because I know I have these loose. So the sword probably just fell out. Okay. Stone Age action playset. This figure is cool. I love the weapon. Just the look of them. Great look for the boots. Wearing like bones and dinosaur leather type stuff. Very cool. Very cool piece. Looks like there's a few different figures. This is the only one I have. Um, it's another Bone Age piece. Tarot. These things are so cool. Um, what is this? this is like a mail away figure. Anything's in it, I might have taken it out. Yeah, there's nothing in there, so the figure is gone. Or not gone, but somewhere else. Here is another one of my favorite pieces. The He-Man New Adventures Skeletor Skull Staff. Mint and sealed box. So amazingly cool. Just like that look on that kid's face. 
amazing. Amazing. Here. Oh yeah, here's like my favorite piece out of this line. Besides the Giganto Dragon, this thing, I believe this thing is rare as hell too. The Ultimate Drago Draconis 2-pack. With the Drago Tigra and the Drago Draconis. They made other figures like this. Like two different color variants, I believe. But this thing is just so cool. Ah, love that line. Alright, here's a card for a Godzilla 2004. What is this thing? What is this? Oh, that's cool. It's a toxic tear from Pacific Rim. It's like Knife Head, I think his name is. That's cool. I don't even recall where I got that from. Oh, this is another awesome piece. This uh, Mexican bootleg Skeletor and Panthor. Still sealed. With the weapons. Very awesome. Another one of those little knockoff He Man on a weird vehicle. Well, here's the other version of that Knight's Kingdom, the one that I took out of the package. Still kept the package though. Hot Wheels card. Really. Bunch of skull candies. It's probably going to use this in a custom piece somehow. A bunch of old photography I found in an attic in a house we were living at. That is crazy. <laughs> Don't know where I made that or if my daughter made it. I think I got this from uh, Joey Rulo. Bought some toys from him and sent me the Beetlejuice art. The Wolf bookmark. There's a Wild Things. The art of Maurice Sendek. When I lived in Tampa, they had a Maurice Sendek exhibit at the museum. And of course, I went. I would have loved to have met him, but he was not feeling well at the time. And so he didn't, didn't make an appearance. But it was awesome to see his original artworks in a museum setting. Another cool bookmark. Double-sided. Little canvases to paint. I think I did this when I was a child. Little doodles. Some more little canvases and a weird five-star demon thing. Well, I know I made this. So it's probably one of these little family events where we made Christmas decorations. For me being who I am, I made creepy stuff. There's a bookmark. And little canvases. Okay. There you go, my friends. There's another bin full of some really cool stuff. I can't wait to set it up and display it in my collection. Until next time, friends, peace. Thanks so much for watching.